If you find yourself in the wrong lane, what's the safe thing to do? So let's get driving. <clears throat> so we'll do a left at the end. So um, when you are learning to dr drive on, on roundabouts, you'll do silly things all the time where you'll, you'll realize you're in the wrong lane. So we're, we're going to go ahead. You can see quite clearly there, you can use the middle lane. I'll slow it down. You'll see it in a few seconds to go ahead. Middle lane, left goes left. So it's pretty straightforward. As long as you've got decent lane discipline, it's not going to be a problem. But, and this is where you've got to remember, it's the safety of you when you're driving, the safety of people in the car with you, and the safety of people around you. So. If you find yourself in the wrong lane, then you just need to go where it's going. So we're gonna go ahead, and this is a typical sort of thing, thing that's gonna crop up, uh, either on your lessons or on even on your driving test. You're not paying attention to, the, to what's ahead of you, so you need to be looking ahead of you. And you realize, oh, I'm in the wrong lane. So what? Check the mirrors to the left, signal left. I'm not gonna change lanes this late, it's too dangerous. I'm checking to my right, and it's as simple as that. Nothing too complicated, it's straightforward. Stick to what's, what is going. Um, if you've got the opportunity to change lanes, then that's different, and, but, you, but you've got to do it safely. You, you can't just suddenly quickly come across to the different, to the lane that you're supposed to be in, because that's going to cause you to be some, doing something dangerous, perhaps be erratic. Maybe you might miss something in your blind spot. You might miss something in your right mirror or your left mirror, depending on which way you're going. Um, and, and they had a, um, a prime example the, the other week. I'm going to just run about actually on the same way. And my pupil's been doing two hours on the way home. She knows the way home at this point. And I'm watching her. She's going to go ahead at the roundabout. And when she gets to it, for some reason, she's convinced she's coming from a different direction. So she starts to check her mirrors to the right, signaling to the right, and positions to put herself in the right lane. Nothing wrong with what she's doing there she's going right at that point everyone knows around her that she's going right when she enters the roundabout she it clicks on her that she's actually needs to go ahead and um, at that point you got two choices which is you go right which is the correct way to do it or you try and force your way across into the to get off which is dangerous so it's basically one choice you've got at the end of it so she's just gonna go right simple as that and um, I said to her I said well if you find yourself in the wrong lane, but just, just as, this is a good example, I'm in the right lane, and I realise I should be going ahead. Um, rather than try and force your way back to the left, just say, right, okay, I've missed my exit. Stay in the right lane, go all the way round, and just count the exits off. So there's your third one, there's the fourth, I'm back where I started, so I'm gonna take the second exit, there's the first. Checking my mirrors, there's my second and you're back on course. That's an easy way to sort out a problem. Rather than force your way across into the left lane, and you can guarantee when you do things like that, you're not properly checking. So keep it simple, keep it safe. So I hope this quick lesson on keeping it simple in the lanes, nothing complicated, is good for you. If it is, like I say, give it the thumbs up, and um, if you're new to my channel, click on that subscribe and watch out for my next video next week.